Okay, I'm gonna do a few, um, stop. A few tarot messages. All right, let's get started. This one's gonna be fast. We're not gonna do a spread or anything. Anything that pops up. We're kind of just going out with the flow. Um, <clears throat> I mean, if you see me looking down, it's because I'm pushing my cat on the floor because I keep trying to get up. Okay, five of, five of cups popping up with the star card. Um, energy of, well, we're about to get to the one that you see right there. But energy of um, looking back look, looking back to something in the past that you want. You want it because you want to take it towards your future. You can see it with the five of cups reminiscing too much. Oh, two of cups. It could be a relationship. It could be a partnership. It could be um, a work thing that didn't work out. Um, a work project. Yeah, four of pentacles, not not grasping it, not holding it, not having it um, s stabilized, and that's what you want. You want something stable to do with that. Three of three of pentacles, yeah, it's about either working with somebody or working in a group or working with um, with with something, you know, some type of collaboration. And the star card keeps popping up every time, so it's something that's like meant to be, that's meant to be part of you, that and you feel it, and that's why it kind of makes you. Not detach from the reminiscing feeling because you feel like this is yours. Ace of Pentacles, yeah. And this is yours. Justice card, this is yours, yeah. High Priestess, you know that this is for you. The Fool card, you know that you have to take a leap of faith towards this. Ace of Swords, um, bringing something up, saying something. Um, <clears throat> leading from, from your strongest thought, from your strongest... The thing that holds you the most... You know, it's like a string that's pulling you. You want to, you're probably going to be like, well, let me turn around and see what that string is pulling me, right? Three of cups. Oh. Three of cups with the uh, two, four, six, eight. With eight of pentacles. Um. Family could be a big thing right now. Family and and um, building together. Oh, okay, family and, and the things you've built together. So that could be anything. Friends and the things you've built together. Relationships and the things you've built together. That's all coming, yeah, Queen of Swords. To be, to be sorted out is what I'm hearing. To be um, discussed. To be upgraded. <clears throat> the empress card popping up um yeah starting with something different definitely gonna be newborn babies everywhere maybe i'm getting a pregnancy i'm, ge I'm getting um um a rebirth yeah i'm getting more child things though and more more of a child thing um a baby maybe inner child things too inner child connections five of five of wands that's where the karma walks in. Uh, well, everybody's karma. Oh. <clears throat> a lot of karmic cycles coexisting with one and with one another, um, throughout groups, throughout people. That's happening a lot. People um, helping each other fix their car fix their karma. What really is fixing karma? Three of Pentacles popping up again. Yeah, that's where they work in together. Um, collaboration again. Emphasis in collab on collaboration. Ow. pops up again um going into a new journey that makes you feel free makes you feel happy five of pentacles leaving somebody something or or another um behind something yeah ow 
leaving something behind um in a way of trying to ignore it it feels like it feels like you're you know trying to cover yourself with the hoodie so you don't have to look back and and see people seeing you leave so there is this sense of like kind of like oh i know this made it a, a, an effect um two of swords that's where your option pops in your option of being real with yourself with the moon up at the top being real with yourself being real with your emotions being real with knowing what you want the four of wands pops up <clears throat> um knowing what you want um bigger picture things you know and not even bigger picture things but bigger picture bigger picture things that you want to bring action towards to to make your reality to make your make it your present to be a part of it five of swords popping up um keeping things from somebody keeping things from from someone or a group keeping things from them but having something to say to them you know it's like it's like i actually made this exact meal for you but um, i'm not giving it to you that's that energy popping up um somebody's not speaking up somebody that's bothered is not speaking up the hanged man in reverse Yeah, finding a new way, a new way of thinking or a new way of um, just a new bright idea is popping up. Ace of Wands that you want to take action on and that you're going to be given the opportunity to take action on. Uh, yeah. Seven of Cups. Because you have the opportunity to take so many actions, so many different actions, you have different choices. It's up to you to make up the choice. What do you want to do? How do you want to do it? Where do you want to do it? Why do you want to do it? When do you want to do it? Ten of Wands, yeah, ending something that was limiting you, that was stopping you, that was hurting the hurting the spine, the sacred chakra. Um, times where you couldn't you couldn't put things into action. Times when you couldn't move into action. That thing that you would daydream consistently about but did nothing about. That's where you're now ending it, and you're wanting to do something about it. Ten of Swords, um, you know, it, it's it. You've numbed it. You've numbed the spine to where now it just wants to walk again. You know, it's forgetting what walking is. And by that, what I mean by all of that, the spine thing, is the way to take action. If your spine's not working, you can take action. You can do things. And if you you know fix the spine, fix the way it moves, feel comfortable with the way that you moved with your spine, you can start taking action. Two of Wands, Ten of Cups. I mean, Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, you're waiting for, waiting to get somewhere, waiting to head somewhere mostly. You're waiting for the future that you know is meant for you, which makes it more challenging. Ace of Swords jumps out. It makes it more challenging to, um, to do because you know it, that you're meant to do it. You know that it's for you, but you still haven't done it. And you're just like, but I know it's for me, you know? Yeah, the Tower card jumps out. You know it's for you. You know you need a you know a clean slate. And bottom of the deck, oh, the lovers. <laughs> this could be very relationship oriented. Orient, orient, oriented. Okay, I'm gonna end it like that. Wheel of Fortune. Good way to end it. Yeah, Wheel of Fortune. Get your fortune. Good things coming in. Good things strolling in. But it is your choice to take them. Take them if you want to. Yes or no. Your choice um yeah but you're gonna have decisions anyways any decision you choose will be good for you if you choose that decision whatever good means to you um yeah hope this helped quick video ow kitty and that's it peace out girl scouts